Greetings everyone. Manupatra brings to you the news highlights of 26 September 2022. Starting with the Supreme Court. The Supreme Court while dismissing a petition which sought a direction that political parties cannot use election symbols allotted to them as party symbols beyond the period of elections has held that relief claimed was disruptive of the election process. While staying the deportation of a woman declared as an illegal migrant the Supreme Court has issued notice in petition impugning order of Guwahati High Court which had affirmed order of foreigners tribunal declaring her to be a foreigner despite her entire family except from her being included in the NRC 2019 The Supreme Court has held that administrative or executive orders or circulars cannot be made applicable with retrospective effect in the absence of any legislative competence. The Honorable Apex Court has held that the failure to produce the accused before the court at the time of consideration of application for extension of time for investigation amounts to violation of fundamental right guaranteed under Article 21 of the Constitution. The Supreme Court has held that an appeal does not lie to the Commercial Appellate Division of the High Court from an order of the Commercial Division Single Bench of the same High Court on addition of a party in an admiralty suit governed by the Admiralty Act. Moving on to the other courts, starting with the Delhi High Court, the Delhi High Court has held that mere presence of a decree of restitution of conjugal rights against the wife does not disentitle her from claiming maintenance from her husband when it is due to his own conduct she is not able to stay with him the high court has directed a private school in delhi to allow an unvaccinated teacher to rejoin his duties after aims concluded that he was at a higher risk of developing an allergic reaction to the covid-19 vaccine as compared to the others The High Court has appealed to senior lawyers in the legal profession to ensure that stipend paid to their juniors is enough for them to overcome the financial stress and to lead a more dignified life. The Delhi High Court has observed that occasional entry of public to a private temple on some festivals does not convert it into a public temple so as to empower a worshipper to maintain a suit with respect to the title rights of the temple. News from the Bombay High Court The High Court while allowing Uddhav Thakre led Shiv Sena to hold the party's annual Dashera rally at Shivaji Park on 5th October 2022 has set aside the BMC's order refusing permission and directed the BMC to grant permission from 2nd October to 6th October 2022. The High Court has granted relief to a retired medical officer of Thane Municipal Corporation whose pension and gratuity was reduced by local body after government clarification said only public health department doctors were to be given extension in service beyond the date of retirement. That is all for today. Thank you so much.